Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. This is a very short video just for those who they are from Indonesia. Somebody sent me a link about an actor supposedly he converted to Islam. And here I noticed that some, some people who claim to be Christians, they are obviously they have a they have a problem. Look like you do not know what it's mean to be a Christian. First of all, an actor who gets naked in front of the camera, he is no Christian. So all those actors even those who wear a cross, who claim today they are Christians, they are not Christians. So when an idiot of you, he got affected because a person who go naked in camera, he became a Muslim. It's mean you have a problem in your mind and you think this is a threat to you. This is not a threat. This is called the filter. We will not be honored to have someone like this between us. So let him go wherever he wants. What's your problem? He's free to believe in anything he wants. Already he is no Christian. And he already he is from different religion. And now he chooses Islam. So what's your problem? Do you feel like you are threatened? Are you not confident? So don't send me those stupid links. Who is this guy? And look, this is the whole point of an actor converting to Islam. They want to use him for propaganda that you see a famous actor converted to Islam. So? <laughs> Let us see if he can leave. Now, if they will leave, if he will leave, they will, they will kill him. <laughs> so, if you are only stupid, you will be affected by such a thing. But the Muslims, remember, they try always to use this this for their own propaganda to show you look a famous actor a famous actor it's a famous whore a famous like who who is the actor what does that mean people who go naked in the camera I'm not going to play the video in front of us you know who is who is the actor you are talking about I mean bring us something you can be proud about but if you feel that you lost something because an actor converted to Islam that's mean because you are stupid not because he is this is his business you want to be a Muslim this is his business but if you who think you are a Christian and you feel you are threatened because somebody converted to Islam is an actor that is mean literally you are mentally ill and you are stupid since when those are Christians have you ever seen Madonna dancing with her panty she wear a cross in her neck and she make fun of Christianity and later you will say to me maybe let us say after 50 years uh, uh, let us say she convert whatever religion are you going to be affected you must be silly so stop this is stupid things don't send me those things this is stupid we have thousands and thousands of good people living in Islam every day not an actor and what will actor would do he will act he will play with his breast to Allah now let him do it it's it's really it's really funny how how uh, naive people in the world function an actor brother an actor and by the way I have to admit that if you're an actor you have influence on the mankind more than someone teaching the truth because mankind is corrupt stupid so because he's an actor three millions watch his video yes because he's an actor this is the truth which means there's a three million donkey they have nothing to do in life except watching an actor who play with his breast That is reality. No, I am not sad for anyone. Why you are sad for him? What's your business? What's your business? If the guy he decided to go to Islam, what's why you are sad for him? Why you are sad for him? No. That's not that's not smart. We are not sad for anyone. People they have the right to make a choice and they go wherever they go. Your, your family member, some of them they will go to heaven, some of them they will go to hell. Being if I'm a church or a Catholic or Protestant will not take you to heaven unless you are a Christian, which means you are really Christian. So don't stop being silly. Most of this earth will go to hell. But because you are mentally ill, you are worried about an actor. What about worry about children who they are dying in the street? What about worry about children are used for sex trafficking? So millions of people now interested of an actor. Yes, this is the truth. Because there's millions of sick-minded people who don't care really for mankind. They care for an actor who is worthy, rich. His life, uh, you know, he's enjoying his life, obviously. So what's your business? Go worry about a child, an orphan, 
worry and go go and see how many in Indonesia they are used for sex trafficking this is what you should worry about if you are a Christian not about an actor who care let him go but the Muslims they will use those propaganda just to fool you to say here we go an actor like a, as if a philosopher and the guy don't even have high school so we we, we bring someone who present not nothing and he converted to Islam and now we want to use him for our propaganda what about the millions of people leave Islam every day go right now search and Google six millions leave in Islam every year 16,000 every day in just in one territory one continent so don't be silly and don't send me those stupid links please how many people they left Islam in my show how many people you witness? Why you people don't make a big fuss about it? We don't make fuss about it. I don't even keep their videos. The one who left Islam, I don't even keep their videos in my channel. So those all those who left Islam in my channel, they don't count for you. An actor he count, yes, an actor he count because you are a silly and you are stupid. Because you are controlled by a screen TV. He's an actor. Okay. So is he going to do this after he converted to Islam? Yes. So you were proud about him when he was a Christian, when he was doing this? Is that what make you like, like him? He's, he was, since when he was a Christian, is that what Christians do? Stop being stupid. Stupidity is amazing. And some people are really, they have, they have, a, they have a brain of a chicken. Here we have the real people who they are leaving Islam every day, not an artist. What artist? You care for an artist? Playboy? So they make their propaganda in order to and bring a lot of people and journal journalists and la 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 Allahu Akbar brother. There is a guy leaving Islam. There is millions of Muslims leaving Islam. What about Indonesian Muslims worry about the biggest nightclubs in the world, which is in Indonesia? In the size of stadiums. What is Islam in Indonesia? Prostitution. I mean, they are they are beating even Thailand. So Islam is exist and the biggest nightclubs and prostitution business exist in the world. What about where your daughters who work in go Saudi Arabia and get raped? Right? So eh, people are silly and people are stupid. I will keep this video just for for a few minutes. Download it right away and we will be back live on on air in an hour and a half from now. And thank you guys for being here. And please don't be stupid and don't be silly. This is garbage. Garbage in, garbage out. Right? Yeah, actually, here we go. Edward, he just uh, said exactly. Man, we are saying the same. I didn't even see your text yet. I said garbage in, garbage out. <laughs> he wrote that before me. <laughs> That's a good one. Uh, now Jesus is not God. No problem. We will be here after two hour, uh, after one hour from now, an hour and a half. And you tell me how Jesus is not God. And by the way, all those you see, almost every day I have Muslims leaving Islam, either live on air, you witness them, or even under air because they don't want to be known from their voice or etc. So we have every day beautiful people leaving Islam. Actors are not really, uh, you know, as I say, every soul is important for God, every soul. But those people, they target them just for the propaganda. God knows what this guy, he did, and they have something against him, and they force him to convert to Islam. We do not know. You know, I don't think even he believe in Islam. You will see. Just watch after he convert to Islam what he will be. Is he going to grow a beard, pray to Allah five times? Or he will go to the bar second day and drink wine and dance with the girls and get naked as usual. Let us see. You know, you will see. Just wait. So don't be silly and don't be stupid. Actually, you know, what about we say the son of Hamas who left Islam? That is something to be 
something. The son of the founder of Hamas left Islam. What about the one that Indonesia and they make a statues for him in Indonesia? His name is Obama. Obama, he claimed that he left Islam. The most famous man. Huh? So, and we don't talk actually. For me, I don't believe Obama is a Christian. He's a liar. So we are not proud about those people. But I can be proud about this person, the son of the founder of Hamas, from the heart of terrorism. He is not only a terrorist, he is the son of the founder of Hamas. He left Islam and he became a Christian. This is someone we can be proud about. Not an artist. <laughs> All right. Anyway, guys, I want to say thank you for being here. May the Lord bless you. Please download the video, put subtitle for it if you are Indonesian share it and we will be back exactly after an hour and 30 minutes from now if you like to join us and the topic today is the magnificent shin of allah he have a very beautiful shin and i hope you will not be excited in case you are a perverted person when we talk about the shin of allah allah has a shin and he is a shin we say hallelujah. What the Muslim should say? Shinnanuya? Hmm? Hmm. You say Jesus is not God because he's a man, but your God, Allah Himself, is a shin. May Allah shin you. May Allah hang you all in his shin. Make you climb it and touch it and massage it. Who is going to massage the shin of Allah? If you are, you are invited to join our program after two hours from now. Actually, after yeah, an hour and a half. You can massage the shin of Allah and you can enjoy it. Thank you very much. So stop mocking Allah. I'm not mocking Allah. You are mocking Allah. When you say God is a shin, that's a stupid of you and you are mocking God, whoever that God is. What kind of God he says he will be known by his shin? I'm so glad he, did not, he didn't say he would be known by his ass. I mean, what's wrong with you Muslims? You say to me, don't mock Allah. You are mocking Allah. If Allah is your God, you mock him by saying that. What we say? What if we say Allah? He will know. He will be known by his pimple. Shin. What about his testicles? What's wrong with you? So after one hour and a half, call me and explain to me what kind of God he is going to be known by his shin. Hmm? So see you in an hour and a half. Don't forget to download the video. We will not keep it for long. Thank you very much for being here. And if you like to learn more about the shin of Allah, you can get my books from Amazon in all languages. See you soon. Christ is Lord. Islam is false. Made for the dummy by the dummies. Thank you.